Plenty people sabi civil society activists them as people where they talk for people where not get platform for talk but in them where they unbug them. This don't make plenty them. People know they call the civil society activists them as the voice of the voiceless. According to waiting the Truth and Reconciliation Commission with Fenots, one of the reasons them will make some people end up for going to bush and fetch the 11 year one as alone. Now because they not been get the platform for talk on issue them where they unbog them na the country. For sake of this, the Truth and Reconciliation Commission report been recommend under recommendation 290 say civil society gets major role for play for monitor and reporting them like misconduct, corruption where don't work close na salon, and other thing them where the government they do we not fine. He carry on say, concerned group them get the right for come together for promote integrity in the public service inside the workway than they do. Something them like this don't they happen in the salon civil society space because plenty civil society organization them don't they and people where they listen radio, watch television or use social media don't they see them activists there they talk on different issue them but sometimes now with different interest. But how the interest here don't be the interest of the voiceless. But first, what in really don't be the work of civil society activists them na salon. Well, civil society um, they work with government, but not they work for government. We work with government for highlight the policy gaps them and draw government attention, you know, um, to their manifesto promises and also. Um, take the public concern to the government and uh, some of them concerned and they, they might be urgent and uh, they're very much important for the peace and stability now with different community and civil society for be bold enough you know for tell government for do the right thing civil society not for not whole government office they're not there in government mainstream offices these are people with the independent and the whole government to task by way of asking for accountability and transparency in the public space and from those people who are stewards of government. So that is what civil society do, uh, will they do. And that is why immediately after the war, you don't get a proliferation of civil society organizations that the country. The next question we go follow now, if really civil society activists them, don't they serve the voice of the voiceless over the years on issue them where the general public not can able for talk for themselves? Well, if I can give me honest opinion about how civil society they carry out their work or how they do things in the society and how people can perceive them, then I will say na a two sides to the coin, you know. But then they then then get some of them they what they do in line with actually waiting expected of them. In as much as we get some, we don't go out of the expectations. You know, hundred percent correct that civil society don't aim for live up to the expectations of the people. We the tell best. Even within the civil society space, we have our challenges. We have political manipulations. We don't be redo, we don't redo, we don't actually be cloud the entire civil society space. Wherein a lot of people now hold so much um, allegiance to certain political beliefs and that they gravely undermine their productivity and their loyalty to the cause of actually holding powerful people to account. You get human rights, I mean, you get civil societies and the advocacy in, in mixed feeling. One, you get the one that we a pro government policy in a civil society. So you go see them, they be in civil society. I mean, government, political party, they propagate political party agenda and ensure that, say, they praise the ministers and praise the president. And in their own eyes and their mind, there's nothing wrong you know for do them thing and day. but then that is civil society because we can call them political civil society and but then you get a civil society where they in the heart of the people's interest you see that say issues that we in a burning issue in a society then in the champion but waiting people think about the work of civil society activists them so far in the country need they determine the whole situation as disappointment as they say, we get a lot of them who we follow. At the point where they can start, we can visit, we don't get voice. We don't get people who they advocate for we. 
but at the end of the whole process we can find out say then he just do him for letting himself be able to get attention from the powers that be what then give their attention then can give them package and he just be quiet so i'm not visiting then they work for we really what you make plenty of people they question them they question their credibility now the fact that some of them don't side with government you know and you cannot mix up things if you say you're in a civil society the people they expect to say you for them are a neutral ground especially in the interest of the people Waiting at the way forward for make Salon Civil Society get the kind rank where it forgets for fulfill what the TRC recommendations say. The way forward, um, if the people of this country want to get a genuine civil society, you know, uh, in higher number, then therefore sacrifice for support civil society. If you don't support civil society to get an ownership of civil society, you won't have it. As civil society activists, let us be truthful to ourselves firstly. We need to be truthful to ourselves. Let us search with souls and know whether we're really ready for do the work. And when once we convince ourselves we are prepared to do the work, let us stand against all forms of challenges will come. With support from MRCG and ATJLF for Glad TV Online Daily Salon Issues, Mina Aisha Kamara, the report.